And our master VLR, they just got the green flag. So it looks like Scott Fermanic is going to be your leader. We have a huge pile up the back there. Let's see what, if I can pick out some of these drivers. That might be Fred Clark is one of them. So if that was Fred Clark, maybe Dan Rivera, Uncle Dan. Let's see who else was that. So that was somewhere right around that seventh spot. Actually, a race leader is Dan Jones. Dan Jones is a race leader. Followed by Giorgio, Giorgio Scott Fermanic, Michael Toon, Dan Rivera. So in their cars, race leader Dan Jones in third place, Scott Fermanic. They both have black suits and black helmets. So I get them crossed up quite frequently because they're both always in the top three. But right now, Dan Jones is the race leader, followed by Gorgeous George, Scott Fermanic, Michael Ting, and Dan Rivera. So on screen right there, that's Scott Fermanic on the right. Michael Team right behind him. There's Michael Team. You'll notice Michael Ting on his cart when he's going one direction. It's white, the other direction it's black. That's the GSC body work. Let's see if Michael Ting has a run here. Coming up the hill, does he have any momentum to get around Scott Fermanic? So on track, Master VLR. This class is brought to you by Radical Northwest. <laughs> Looks like Dan Jones is pulling out a more comfortable lead. He just went purple that last lap. Running in second, Gorgeous George. Running a third stop for Manning. Looks like there might be contention right there for that third spot between Fermanic and Ting. And then right behind them we have Dan Rivera. And then a little further back we have David Kayo. So right now we're going to keep the cameras on Scott Fermanic, cart number 744, and Michael Ting, cart number 786. So all of these carts on track, 100 cc single speed air cooled engines. They're all manufactured by Vortex. The model is called VLR. Let's see what Michael Tim does here in the next couple of laps. Elsewhere on the track, we're scanning for other races going on. So right now, the battle really is right here for third place. So it looks like Dan Jones is very comfortable 
leading this race as he set another fast lap. Giorgio's Giorgio is running in second. We just saw a glimpse of him a moment ago. But here we have Scott Vermetta coming on the third over his rival, Michael Ting. So if you guys enjoy race commentary, Michael Ting posts on social media his race recaps. <clears throat> and he provides a different perspective from a driver's standpoint of how his race weekends went. We were joking around with him at the last race trying to do a wireless camera setup, but no one wanted to load us a cell phone. But here he is, pressuring Scott Fermanek for that third spot. Once again, the Master VLR class is brought to you by Radical Northwest. Here's a great shot of the drivers coming down the tic-tac-toe. We are running the sprint layout. Very tight, very technical. There's a lot of opportunities for passing, but there's also a lot of opportunities for crossovers and for drivers to retain their positions. Well, it looks like we have some action in the back. That looks like that's Fred Clark. I'm trying to grab a cart number. That might be Huron James and Fred Clark. So we have Fred Clark in cart number 715. So that looks like it's going to be Kieran James. And then possibly Sherry Camilla might be in that mix right there. And now we're picking up uh, third place again. Looks like Scott Romantic has a little bit of a cushion since the last time we checked in. There's your race leader, Dan Jones. Dan Jones, you just saw him at the bottom of your screen. Giorgio's Giorgio was that white cart that went through. All right, now we have battle with Fred Clark. I think that's Kieran James that he's battling with. I'm having a hard time grabbing the cart number, but I believe it's Kieran James, cart number 768, that Fred Clark is battling with. And this is the battle for 11. So right here, there's your leader, Dan Jones. So we're going to try to give Dan Jones some love here. He's your leader. He's been leading since the opening lap. Part number 714 on that CRG. So right now, Dan Jones has a two and a half second lead over second place, Giorgio Giorgio. And I have to give a quick shout out to Slow Joe Becker. Said I could call him Slow Joe, not sure why. But currently Slow Joe is running in eighth. 
part number 718. But on screen, we have Dan Jones. So we have seven laps to go as Dan Jones comes across the start finish line. So we're gonna to try to grab the racing action again between Scott Fermanek and Michael Ting. Scott Fermanek is in the 744. Michael Ting is in the 786. So with this sprint layout, it's allowed the drivers to spread out a little bit. Normally this class is a little bit tighter than more bunched up. But with the sprint layout, you can see the separation on the drivers. Deion Jones is still the current race leader. Gorgeous George is in second, Scott Fermanek in third. Michael Tate fourth, Dan Rivera fifth. Hello, Uncle Dan. Let's see, six, we have Stefan Goudreau, seven, David Cole. In eight, Slow Joe Bender. Ninth, Kyle Armstrong. Tenth, Fred Clark. Eleventh, we have Kieran James. And running back in twelfth, we have Alexander, Alexander Schuh. Stepping it up a little bit. He's right on that rear bumper of Scott Fermanek. It's always fun to have a camera on Michael. He always makes it exciting. So let's see what he does in these next couple of quarters here. And we'll have to look at lap times. It looks like they might be closing in on. Georgia's Giorgio. So right now there's a 1.9 second gap between Fermanic and Georgia's Georgia's George. So we'll keep an eye on that gap. We're also watching for Manic and Michael Ting. There hasn't been many attempts here for a pass. So these two drivers are getting a lot of camera time. We're looking for race and action everywhere on the track. One of our series sponsors is Blaze one-on-one -on -one coaching. And at the last race, Michael Ting said he took advantage of their coaching services and he was pretty impressed with the mental approach that they have. So shout out to one of our series sponsors, Blaze One-on-One -on -one Coaching. I wonder if Team GFC is biting their nails watching the driver, Michael. Trying to guess what he's gonna do next. Well, he looks to the inside, but there's not enough room there. <clears throat> Let's see, the split between Gorgeous George and Scott Fermanek. George is holding 
he's holding his cushion. But really, the race for position is right here on camera between Scott Fermanick and Michael Tin. And he looks like he's gonna make a move. Come on, Michael, just pull the trigger. Make it happen. Give us some video here. Help us out. The drivers need to come around. They're gonna have one lap to go when they come across the start and finish line. So your leader, Dan Jones, just took the white flag. So here's your race leader, Dan Jones. We're gonna try to give our leader a little bit of camera time. We have an eyeball on that battle for third, but it looks like Scott Fermanick has a little bigger cushion than he did the lap before. Let's see if Michael Toot can close the door. But meanwhile, here's your race leader. Dan Jones, cart number 714. So here comes Dan Jones with the race win. Gorgeous George finishing second. Scott Fermanick finishing third. Michael Ting in fourth. Go ahead. Then we have Dan Rivera coming in fifth. David Ko sixth. Stefan Gagro seventh. Kyle Armstrong eighth. Joe Bender running in ninth, and Fred Clark in tenth. 